The year is 1955. Uncle Moses has taken Emmett to Money, Mississippi. Him being all black boy joy, his mother all black woman worry, with the same worry I have instilled in myself, the same fear I have every time I see my brother leave the house and tell him to be safe because I know the son kissed him a little more, and some folks find that downright offensive. This is for boys like Emmett. Emmett, so eager to get to a place that despises his existence, so full of life not knowing it would be short-lived, so much melanin distilled in your face, not realizing that your race was the only thing needed to prove you guilty in a case you would never even make it to. To be black, proud, and confident was a cardinal sin. Better get a death wish, like how dare you allow a whistle towards a white woman escape your lips and rest so comfortably in the same wind bodies like yours sway in. But your boyish charm was not impressive to the white man with a god complex and devil-like tendencies. So you casually became a casualty as you lay shot, beat, bruised, and held down in the Tallahatchie River, because Massa wanted to see how well you could really wade in the water. With cotton gin around the waist, they tried to make you an anchor. But what they did not know is you refused to sink, refused to be whitewashed out of this world. They told me money was the root of all evil. I guess they were right. Woo!